Hello guys, it's Cody. In this video, I'm gonna show you this file converter shortcut. I often use it to convert a PDF to EPUB, uh, but you can use it to convert any files. You can manually input the file format for the uh, output file. It also works on Mac. You can run it and you uh, right click on a file uh, in the finder app and select quick action and select the shortcut uh, it's also you can run it from share sheet on your iphone or ipad so this is required so let me go to uh telegram as you see uh, someone sent send me uh pdf files so i want to uh, convert it to epub so i can use my uh, book uh, ibook app to view uh, to a read the book so I'm click select and uh, tap share so I don't have to leave this telegram app and uh, select this file convert shortcut and tap it so I I can select uh, EPUB or MOBI and you can select manually manual input to uh, input the file format that you want so I'm going to select EPUB here uh, always allow. Uh, always allow. That's been complete. Okay. Allow. Uh, always allow. This is only you have to type uh tap it when you run it for the first time. So I'm gonna select a location to save the file. I just save it on my iPad and select a download uh folder. Okay. Uh exit. And you can run it cut convert another if you want. Open the files app. Where's the files app? And download, let's say, love without limits. Ah, I can read it in my books. See? Okay. Well, let's go back to the shortcut. So this uh, is requires the file. The cloud convert API. You see this coming here. Uh, go to cloudconvert.com to create an API, and then put your API code here in this text section here. Uh, paste your API key here, and you can use it uh, on your iPhone or Mac. So you can you can run it from here and select files. Uh, select a file from the. Uh, f files app. Okay, I can also run the face. So let's try on an image. Okay. So let's try this image. So I can come and select manual input and select web p. Okay, tap down. Always allow. Okay, tap down. Okay, let's also save it to this download folder. Okay, exit and go back to the files app. See this webp file. Get info to webp. So you can manually input or I only have uh, options. So you can add, add other options if you want for quick acts, quick quick conversion. You can add your own options. I only add two options, EPUB and MOBI. You can you can add new items. You can delete the, uh, the existing one or add new items, and you can add a tag section and. And just uh, add the 
format here. Okay, that's um, pretty much it for this video. Hope you find it helpful. As always, thank you for watching. I'll share the shortcut link in the description. You just click the link to add it to your iPhone or Mac. So I will, as always, I'll see you in the next one.